principles on how to be a productive, effective, and powerful praise leader or a leader, how to really worship. And it's not even necessarily a, to how to be a leader in church, but even a leader at your workplace and a leader at home. Because what starts here needs to be taken out of here. Amen. So whether you're a worshiper here, you got to be a worshiper out there. Amen. So I ask each of you to, if, if you if you can, to come in and... And it's going to be real uh, informal if you have questions that, uh, that we're going to take time to do that. Now, enough of the, the commercial here. <laughs> but it says the Lord inhabits the praises of his people. Oh, yeah. But it also can mean that, that too, that the devil inhabits the praises of his people too. And what that means is that if you're letting worry and stress issues keep you out of the presence of God, you're giving the enemy praise. So God has given us an opportunity when he gives us this sanctuary to come into this place and to praise your way out of those issues. God delivered me in my praise and worship. And he has given us this opportunity to, lead, to lay aside all those weights and give him the honor and glory that's due his name. Come on. Let's lift up a shout of praise to the one and only true God. All those little G-O-D's are going to take it over. They have to bow in the name of Jesus. Oh God, look at the praise. We lift up high above everything. Come on, here we go. When you count to your friends, lift up the name of Jesus. And you hear the music playing. And you see the people Oh, yeah.
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What a great God.